So our final, our penultimate race from Haydock, should I say, is a three-mile four furlong Tim Maloney handicap. So Boomerang, a man for Graham Clutterbuck's number one. Their top weight, Weeby Clarity for Martin Liebham is two. Divinite, Agus for Stu Gray and Quality Queen make up three and four. Cert for Martin Liebham is fifth. Five. And Jameer Kotcher for Thomas Rogers is six. And just six of them to go over three and a half miles here. Star's already got him away. Next, well, the first, should I say, of the 21 we've got to take. They'll jump that well. Maybe Clarity was a little bit uh, slow over it. Nobody wants to take this up. There's no pace in the race. And it's just quality queen, just by a length, I suppose. Nothing in all the time. He's got a length of Archie leading them down to the second. Just a plain one. Keeps it well. This time, uh, Weeby Clarity got over it much better. So it's Quality Queen from Weeby Clarity on the inside. Then we've got Grey, Divinite, Aquas between those. It's Boomerang, a man. And Cirque. And just Jimmy and Cottage, the widest of all. So we come down to the third. Oof, a couple of mistakes there. Big mistake by Quality Queen. Gave plenty of air. Worst off was Weeby Clarity. We've only done one fence out of three well. Looking to jump a little bit better. And a further 18 to take. So it's Quality Queen that leads us past the main post for the first time. Now for another couple of circuits. And Quality Queen. About three to serve who just nosed into second. But oh, there, Boomerang a Man and Divinite Agus. Just length behind is Cirque. Weeby Clarity. Junior Cottage. That's so Quality Queen. Bowl along in the front. It's by about three to Boomerang a man. Gray on the outside is Divinite Agus. But Martin Lee and Runners serve and Weeby Clarity as you go over the fourth. And slow over it was Jameer Cottage towards the rear. So we move through the first mile and it's Quality Queen that leads us. And boomerang a man. Gray, Divinite Agus. Weeby Clarity and Cirque. It's just six. We need to be had for everybody. Bar one. It's quality clean. Leads him into the plain one. Still maintains his two length advantage from the boomerang and there. Dip my head was just being given a couple of reminders to stay on the job. So can we be clarity together? Junior Cottage. It's pretty much as we were. Seventh. Let's jump there this time by Weeby Clarity on the inside. Approach the next, the ninth. It's open ditch. Weeby gets over that well. So Quality Queens leads now, just a length and a half to Weeby Clarity. Did not have us on the outside. Between those is Boomerang a man. Where there still is Cirque and Junior Cottage up against the fence. Again, much closer order. As they come down to the final two miles, it's still this quality queen that's led since the beginning. Boomerang a man now. Weeby Clarity. One is Divinite Agus. Over the ninth. Divinite Agus was a little slow over that. Should be back. There's probably only eight lengths from first to last. Junior Cottages could easily make that up as they go over the tenth. So, quality queen. Boomerang a man, Cirque, Weeby Clarity, Divinite Agus, Junior Cottage. So approach the 11th, and get over that. So, half the fence is damp, just another 10 to take, and still this quality clean. Queen <laughs> has got a five length advantage now, as the others have chucked and gone back a little bit. Still no pace as they come to the twelfths. It is over it. And the slow jump of the rear by Jameer Cottage, which has just fallen off the back of the chasing pack. It's still only a couple of lengths. So we go past the winning post for the second time. One more time. It will be the winner. Quality Queen will hopefully be there. She's got a three length advantage from Weeby Clarity. Boom around the man. By Cirque, and the ground the outside, Divinite Agus, Jameer Cottage. So they're all still on their feet here. So they're going to come down to the 13th. 
which sometimes can be unlucky. Another mile and a quarter still to run. We'll get down to the business end of the race. Ooh, it was nearly a mistake for Weeby Clarity as she went straight through the top of it. It's getting a little bit of momentum to put a challenge down to this quality queen that's still leading. And just three lengths as I come down the back straight. And the lengths back to Did Night Aguas and Boomerang a man. Jimmy Cottage. And bowling along towards the rear. Against the row. So with just a mile left to travel. It's a quality queen. We'd be clarity making up a bit of ground now to try and challenge over this fence, and he does, jumps it better. So Quality Queen's joined by Weeby Clarity. It's to a neck and neck. And race downhill. Divinite Agus has been pushed along a little bit. Inside is Surf. And you've got Boomerang a man. And Jamea Cottage. So Quality Queen gives way to Weeby Clarity as we approach the 15th. They both jump it well, as well as Surf. Got a length advantage away from Divinite Agus in fourth. Boomerang a man and Jamea Cottage open ditch. They all get over that, and this Weeby Clarity is now got a length and a half advantage from Quality Queen on his inside. Serp trying to run on now. Did not have this as an ass for anything yet. Boomerang a man, our top weight is uh, being given a few reminders now to get into this. Jimmy Cottage is still sitting and hasn't made a move, but it's Weeby Clarity being joined by Quality Queen on the outside. Weeby Clarity going on the inside, so Weeby Clarity, Quality Queen, these two lead by three or four lengths. Here comes Boomerang and Man and Divinite Agus on the inside is Serp. Jimmy Cottage has gone widest of all, so we're inside the final half mile. It's Weeby Clarity just by a nose as they come down to the 19th, and it's Quality Queen. Weeby Clarity and it's Quality Queen that takes into the ditch first, gets a half length advantage. So Quality Queen from Weeby Clarity. Clarity. There's three furlongs left to run and two to jump. It's Quality Queen. Weeby Clarity. Here comes Divinite Agus. The grey on the outside is Boomerang and Man. Jameer Cottage and Circle got a little bit to find. So as we come down to the penultimate, Quality Queen and Weeby Clarity go over it together and it's still Quality Queen. Just by half a length. Here comes Weeby Clarity on the inside. Divinite Agus on the outside and Quality Queen gives way to Weeby Clarity. When it matters inside the final furlong with just the last to jump and it's Weeby Clarity. But here comes Divinite Agus to throw down a chance. They're over it together. And it's Weeby Clarity gets away from it best. But here comes Divinite Agus. We've only got half a furlong to run. Weeby Clarity, Divinite Agus. Weeby Clarity, Divinite Agus. Can Divinite Agus get up? Can Weeby Clarity hang on to this? And it is just going to be hung on to by Weeby Clarity. Martin Weedham wins the Tim Maloney handicap. And it's Weeby Clarity. He lost Cirque at the last. Doesn't matter though. He's held off Divinite Agus. That's a win for Martin Ladum. Second was Divinite Agus for myself. Third was a Boomerang a man for Grey Clutterbuck. Third was fourth was Quality Queen for Stu Gray, our long-time leader. And fifth was Jameer Cottage for Thomas Rogers.